Hi, I'm Lara. Welcome to today's play along for the song Feeling Groovy, also known as the 59th Street Bridge Song. This is a wonderful short three chord song and I'm going to do a short tutorial before the play along just to give you a few tips on how to play the chords and a few different ways that you can play this song. You'll find a link down in the description to the lyrics and the chord diagrams. So let's get started. There are only three chords in this song and they are D, A, and B minor 7. Now B minor 7 is a bar chord that goes across all four strings on the second fret. When I play this chord, I like to back up my index finger with pressure from my middle finger. It makes it a bit easier for me to press down on all four strings evenly to get a nice clean sound. This song uses one chord sequence through the entire song. It starts on D, and then goes to A, B minor 7, and then back to A. So if you learn this sequence, you'll be in good shape to play through the entire song because this repeats throughout. The easiest way to play this song in your right hand is to do a down strum with each chord change. So the first couple lines could sound like this. Slow down, you move too fast. You've got to make the morning last. I want to point out that I'm playing a low G on my tenor. If you have a high G, you can still play the same finger picking patterns. Yours will just sound a little bit different because your G will be an octave higher than mine. My favorite way to play this song in my right hand is with a nice light finger picking pattern. It's a very sweet song and sometimes the strumming can sound a bit heavy. So the pattern that I like to use sounds like this. I'm playing this by starting on the fourth string going to the third string, and then playing strings one and two together. And the rhythm here is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So playing the first two lines of the song using this pattern would sound like this. Slow down, you move to a variation on this pattern at the end of the verses after the ba da 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 feeling groovy after those lines so here's what this sounds like i'm starting on d and playing strings 4 down to 1 doing the same on a on B minor 7, I'm going back to my first finger picking pattern, strings 4, 3, and then 1 and 2 together. And then on the last A, I'm finger picking all four strings at once. Next, we're going to move into our play along. I'll be singing the song at the regular tempo. So if it's a bit too fast for you, then slow down the speed of the video, and that will make it easier to follow along. If you're trying to focus on the chord changes in your left hand, then just start off with a basic down strum in your right hand, and save the finger picking for next time. If you're enjoying this video, please give it a thumbs up, and thank you so much for subscribing. Now let's sing the song together. Five, six, seven, eight. Slow down.
Got no deeds to do, no promises to keep. 